Our solution here was to have a screen that pivots out from each of the side walls of the gallery, allowing the congregation to see whether they're sitting in the main body of the church or underneath the galleries, as well as those up above. The system is purely manual in this case. It folds out, is held by a magnetic catch, and then the screen surface drops. There's an identical unit on the other side of the church and it means that wherever you're sitting, you can either pick one or the other screen to look at. At the rear of the church, we have two high-powered Panasonic projectors with long throw lenses, which give great images. And because of the way the screen is deployed, the image fills the screen perfectly every time. So there's no adjustment. Sitting here, my view would normally be blocked because I have a pillar right in front of me. But because there's a second screen, the option is to look at that one instead of the one that's directly in front of me. So it means that anyone in the whole building can see at least a whole of one screen. Here at the rear of the church, between the two projectors, you can see there's a central monitor screen. This is so that those on the dais at the front can see what's on the screens either side of them. We've used for distribution in this particular case HD Base T, which is a means of sending high quality HDMI signals over network cables without any loss. It's very reliable because you can send over large distances, unlike normal HDMI cables. And it's a system that we typically use in most of our installations these days. Thanks for watching. I hope this has given you an insight into what might be possible in your church. Please do click on the like and subscribe buttons and take a look at our website churchsoundsystems.co for more information.